Congratulations on your first official UFC win. How does Thank it you. feel? No, I feel so blessed right now. This is like a dream come true. And it's just half of my big goal I got. And nothing. I feel so blessed for this opportunity and for this finish. Now, do you think that uh, we're going to get these crazy three-round wars from you over and over and over? Because your last one was another three-round war. And this one was basically three full rounds. Yeah, I'm an excited fighter. Every time you, I step on the cage, I'm going to do my my best to be the best fighter and the more spectacular guy in, inside of the cage. And that's what I did every time I step on it. So what did you do in that third round to get that finish? I, I just stay positive and I keep working the body. I, I saw I was hitting him every time I hit him on the body. So I say whenever he dropped his hands and his head a little bit, I'm going to take his head off. Did you feel like you were going to get that finish or in your brain were you thinking this is going to the, to the judges? Uh, every time I'm working for the finish, every, every punch I throw is looking to cause damage and, and to finish the fight. So I was looking for the finish, but if not, I know I was going to get the, the decision anyways. Now, did you know that the um, one judge gave Roosevelt the first round? Did you did you see the scorecards at all? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, 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 the first round, I think it was his best round. He he started uh, very active with his jab, very fast with his jab. But once I feel him, his jab, I say, oh, okay, his jab is fast, but it's not that strong. I can take it. So let's put him against the cage and start punishing him. Were you surprised it, it took so long to put him down? Um... Not really. I, I, like, I, I'm, I'm ready to fight the three rounds, even five rounds if, if I need to. So I was just pushing hard. And whenever I feel him slowing down, I start coming a lot higher. So I've been the heat and he couldn't handle the heat. And I'm not sure if you've seen the other fights or the fights before you, but we had a lot of um, KOs and finishes tonight. How do you think yours stacks up against the others so far? No, I think my my knockout was pretty impressive, but I'm gonna leave everything for for the UFC people. Like, let's see what if they're gonna give me the bonus. And I, I don't know. I think my fight just not just the knockout. It was like a very good fight. The whole fight it was a a war, and I finished it like having like less than 30 seconds on the clock. So that that make it a lot more important. You know, in your last fight, um, a lot of people thought that you were robbed of a fight of the night bonus there. Um, is there any worry that you won't get that this time? And you, you're, you're, um, like you said, you could possibly be a fight of the night. Yeah, I, I'm just calm. I, I just come here to do my job. And everything that comes with it is just a, another bless. So what, whatever the people of the UFC got for me, I, I'm going to be happy. I'm just feeling blessed for being on, be on here and have this opportunity to represent my, my country and my all Latin American people. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. The only thing for me is, did you hear the clapper when, um, when the, the bout, when you, right before you got the finish? Yeah, yeah. Whenever I got his head, like, I was waiting to him to pop up, to hit him with an elbow. Whenever I hit the elbow, I hear, tack, 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 and I say, Okay, so I switch my guard and I feel I feel that kick on my on my on my hip and I I see his head dropping a little bit so I throw it and I say oh thank you God. And when you made contact, did you could you feel with that strike how solid it was and, and the damage that immediately that it did? I like whenever whenever I feel a knockout, I didn't feel it too much on my leg, but I feel like more on my hips and and whenever I hit him and and I see his face, I say okay, he's done. And a lot of times it seems like they were saying like you were using that move, you're going towards the body, you're going to the body, and then you finally used it for the head. Was that something that you've done in practice or was that something that just sort of opened itself up here that you just, you knew the time was running out and you're, you figured you'd just go all, go for everything with it? Like we, we know with this guy couldn't hold it too much in the body. So we know we weren't, we weren't going to attack the body. So we trained it a lot to go to the body. But whenever I was thinking, because it was hard to hit on the face because he was pulling back a lot, using his shoulder to cover a lot. So, <clears throat> so I say, okay, so I'm going to hit the body. So the head drops, drops and let's take the, the head off. Would you say that that was your best finish of your career? It, right now is the most important. Congratulations. Thank you.